Hello guys, I will show you a very uh, simple tutorial about how to create your uh, microstation DJM file, how to convert this file into PDF file and share with others who don't have microstation platform installed on their computer. So uh, the first thing what I'm gonna do is open <coughs> a microstation file. Uh, which may be this one open this file okay this is my file and I want to convert this DGN file into PDF file so uh, the process is this go to file menu and choose print options uh, <coughs> the print dialog box appears and from here you must do uh, you must click on this uh, this button here and uh, usually it open this directory C program data Bentley microstation workspace system PLT CFG and from here you must choose this file PDF dot PLTCFG. Open this file uh, and when when you open this file here uh, there is option for uh, to choose about the size of the paper of the PDF. Uh, you can click show design show design in preview to show your uh, window which will be printed into PDF file. I recommend you to not choose this option rasterize because PDF is created very slowly and the quality is uh, not very good. So turn off this option, uh, choose the paper. Uh, usually I choose the large paper from here which is ANSI E and uh, this is the large paper size for your document and uh, you can make uh, 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 this in this this list you can uh, have better view than other than other lists for example NCD, CDA so uh, for example uh, if I choose NCE you can see that my scale on the project will fit in one one hundred twenty-two. Uh, but if I choose another another paper, for example NCA, when I maximize the window, you see that the scale now is almost five hundred, and this is poor quality. Uh, if you want a bigger project project like this to see uh, good in PDF file you must choose the large paper from here so choose the NCE and click maximize button this will fit the entire, <coughs> entire drawing into the paper uh, and uh, click this print button when you click this print button another window will pop up and will ask where to save this PDF file. So, for example, I can save it on my E drive, and this is the name of the PDF file. Click Save button, and after a few seconds, these PDFs are creating very fast. And here we go, our PDF now is ready. Here you can uh, read, finish it, create it, print, and directory where and the place when, where we choose for this PDF. So when you go to uh, this location, you will find this PDF file. I can open it right now, and you see, you will see that my DGN file now is converted into PDF file and this is only 25% from the drawing when I choose 100% you see that this drawing is pretty big and uh, 
is good for reading right now you can choose for example 200 percent and it's even better for reading and uh, 400 percent and so on so this this PDF file this drawing is now converted into a uh, micro station into uh, I'm sorry into PDF document and you can share this document with everyone who don't have microstation platform and the size of this PDF is pretty low you can see it is under under one megabyte uh, let me show you another example uh, if I choose uh, a small a small smaller paper so back to our mark micro station and uh, for example on the paper dialog box uh, I will choose this ANSI A paper and you can see right now my scale of the drawing when I when I click ma maximize and fit the drawing into this paper <coughs> the scale for this drawing is almost 500 so when I create new PDF file with this paper size I will rename it as 001 save and open open the new PDF file you can see right now this is 100 100% of this PDF file and when you click for example 200 you will see that that this PDF file is not very uh, very is not readable. You can choose 400, but uh, as you can see, uh, the lines, the text, and everything else is not very good for reading. You can do like that, but it's not very good for reading. Uh, this is for this is because uh, this project is very large, large, and it uh, it can it can't fit on uh, this size of paper to read it well. So if you have bigger projects like this, you must choose. You must choose. Lar larger paper this is the larger one as a you can check uh, this is the uh, the area 111 by uh, 886 so uh, you can actually there is a bigger one we saw we saw okay never mind and this is a very simple way to create your DJM file to convert your DJM files into PDF files and that's it for this for this tutorial this tutorial for more tutorials about microstation Bentley you can uh, you can visit my website which is uh, down here I will show you a link in the comments so you can go go there find my website and uh, you can and uh, you will see more tutorials on this website uh, thank you very much guys I hope that this tutorial is useful for you and I hope you to see you next time bye bye for now